Good afternoon, you guys. Welcome to our very our third single booster or collector booster box opening of Modern Horizons 2. This is the third one this week, in fact. But I've been putting it up every couple days and y'all been liking it, so why not keep going with it? Took a while to fill today, but it is also Saturday, which that means everyone is or most people are off. Hopefully you're enjoying your time with your families. If you're not with your family and you're just by yourself, hey, rest up. Got to get back to the hustle next week. Give me a second to get you guys tagged in here. All right, Matt Belvedere got you in here. We got Sutherland. There you go. James Warner. And then Chris Robido. Just four of you. A-OK. -okay. Give me just a moment, you guys. I just got to fix something real quick. Or adjust something, I should say. All right, sweet. Let's go ahead and get you guys over on the randomizer and start rolling this dice, getting the party started. I'm gonna roll these two D6. We got a six, let's go for it. All right, let's see if uh, Matt or Chris or both get a mega stack today. And last round, boom, wow. Gotta love how the randomizer does that to where it doesn't give you your mega stacks. Mm. Gotta love it sometimes, right? Obviously being sarcastic. I hope everyone's having fun today. Safe little weekend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bat. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you did at roll five, but we had that last roll that we had to complete to finish everything out but hey that's all good it is all good all right randomizer code is in the comments for you guys to click on if you want check out see how it was all randomized all right since y'all got y'all spots we know this isn't a long break at all so let's just go ahead and hand out the 12 packs get to cracking and uh back to our weekend right spread the love See if we can't get another uh, force of negation. Cause we got two the or we got two so far, and uh, they've been pretty much from the same palette. So, all right, there we go. We're just gonna go ahead and get the first stack up here and just get the party started. All right, stack one going over to James. All right, as always, you guys, best of luck to all of you. May I pull you? May I pull you all fire? We have a little bit of fun. Listen to me talking to myself and just say stupid stuff, you know, and see some sweet cards because that's what we're always going for. All right, per the use, just skipping through the first few commons that we got in here. We're gonna have Lazatep Chancellor, Underworld Cookbook. And the foil edge mountains. I love those basic foil edge cards. And then our first borderless card of the day. Damn! It's it's one of those cards you just gotta kind of say it. Like maybe not out in public because people think you're an idiot. But unless you're at the 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 your LGS, you know, then everyone's like, you see, you got the card, huh? Ether Sworn Sphinx into a Priest of Felride sketch. We got Nested Shambler, Abundant Harvest, Soul Herder. First rare foil etched card is a Karmic Guide. <laughs> Damn, Denya. Yes, there we go. Full art foil Misty Rainforest right off the bat in the very first pack. Gotta love that. And even more, we got the beautiful Treasure Thopters.
Oh, question for the room. So if you guys, okay, you guys don't know because I haven't said it yet, but I do have one of my other co-workers in here with me today, Ethan, hanging out with me, doing some cards. Say hi, Ethan. Hello. So, question for the room from Matt Belvedere. He says, Pilsner or a tangerine and pineapple IPA? <laughs> tangerine and pineapple. Uh, uh, mm. That sounds good, but I think I have to go with the Pilsner. Here we go, Young Necromancer. A squirrel sanctuary and a foil etched forest into Brea's Apprentice for our borderless card here. First one in this pack, at least. Lens Flare into, yet again, a shardless agent. I'm pretty sure we get one of these with every collector box now. I'm almost convinced with that. We got a Fairy Seer. Rakdos Headliner. Galvanic Relay. And then our foilish card is a Plague Engineer, followed by none other than an Ice Fang Codal Retro Foil from Modern Horizons. <laughs> it's kind of odd. It's still it's still odd to me to see that. But I know uh, James pulled that, that Misty Rainforest from his first box, so this is just extras for him. Moving on to stack two, the Brodal, the Ice Fang Brodal. All right, stack two, going on to Chris Robodeau. Let's go. All right, what's everyone doing this weekend? I bet y'all can't guess what I'm doing right now. I'm working. That's literally what I'm doing. Tomorrow, though, that's a whole other story. Guess what I'm going to do? I can't even really give you an answer because I don't even know what I'm going to do. Filigree attended with the Foilage Swamp. Kabaz the Glimmer Wasp. I told you, I, I like the way this wasp, Glimmer Wasp, looks. Oh, you went with the IPA too, huh? So you're not the only one, Ethan. Matt also went with it. Gargadon, Rise and Shine Sketch. <laughs> You're going to go skydiving, huh? And just didn't know which drink to take with you? Or are you going to drink the IPA while you're skydiving? Because if so, we got to see a video or else it didn't happen. Because that's... I've that's seen some videos of people trying to drink stuff while skydiving, and it doesn't work out so much. Terminal Agony into Ranger Captain of Eos Mythic Rare. Foil etched retro frame from Modern Horizons. And then an inevitable betrayal in the big boy spot. I think, I personally think they should have did the foil etched cards as the last card instead of like the retro foils. Maybe it's just me, but I think so. All right. There we go. Got the commons out the way. We got a liquid metal torque. Gorilla Shaman into a foil edge forest. And then we have a suspend borderless art. Late to dinner. Come on, give us something sweet. We've been getting some sweet stuff in that second spot right there. Sithis Harvest Hand. Foil or foil etched sketched. And we got Weather the Storm, Goblin, and Archimancer. Glimmer Baron, followed by an Archmage's Charm from Modern Horizons Retro Frame Foil Etch. It's a beautiful card. And then a Sylvan Anthem in the big boy spot. I'm just I'm more impressed by the foil etch cards. You know, they just it looks so so much better. And you think about it when they started doing it in Commander Legends. It was like the foil edge cards were what, almost exclusive. You know what I'm saying? Like they're almost like cool to get. Now you just kind of just hand them out. At least that's what it seems like to me. I don't know about y'all. Y'all know how I get on Saturdays. I just start talking about random stuff. All right. Stack three going over to Matt. Let's go, Matt. Let's get it. 
Uh, we've gotten the Ranger Captain of Eos. That was a mythic rare. It's the retro, basically, reprint from Modern Horizon. We got that one. All right. First couple of commons out the way. We got a Bone Shredder. Sea Drake. And then Mountain Foilage followed by a Sanctifier Envec. But we have gotten a full art foil misty, so that was cool. Faithless salvaging. There we go. Elemental incarnation. Mythic rare full art. There we go. Just one of the five. That's sweet. Soul snare. World weary. Weather the storm into a vindicate foil esh, which this is also another one of those cards that's starting to seem common for us. And we got Zabaz the Glimmer Wasp Borderless Foil this time. I think this is the first foil one of him we've gotten. We've gotten a lot of him borderless. All right, bird food. Second pack, let's get it. We haven't gotten a... Uh, Misty's the only fetch that we've gotten, though. We haven't gotten any other fetches, so someone might get, like, three or four fetches. All right, which... You know, wouldn't be a problem, right? Yavi Maya Elder, Mishra's Factory, but a foil etched island. I almost said full art because, you know, full art. Usury, Fortune's Flame. Get that a lot too. We got an Arcbound Shikari, a Sarah's Emissary sketch. I absolutely love This is one of my favorite sketches just because of like the watercolor. Y'all know how I am with angels. Love me some angels. So, like, the watercolor in it looks pretty sick. Kind of gives it, and also, like, you know, the unfinished product look, too. It's pretty sweet. Blacksmith skill. Gargadon. Yavi Maya Elder. Into a Territorial Kavu foil etched. And a Nykthos Paragon. Nykthos Paragon foil sketched. There we go. A Crab Clue token. Excuse me. Sorry, guys. All right. That's pretty sweet, though. Love that look. And you got two mythics here. One of them being the uh, Borderless Fury. That's sweet. All right. Going on to stack four. Going over to Sutherland. Also known as Clem and Tyne. Get it? Clem and Tyne. Ha ha ha. Josh is hilarious. But y'all ready for summer? It's already here in my office. I'm just waiting to let it out. It's hot. Got a brainstone. Feast of sanity. Foil edge planes in two. There we go, our second fetch of the day, a borderless Mars Flats. Come on, give us something else there. Kitchen Imp. In a solitude, elemental incarnation borderless, mythic rare. That's sick. We had that one box, there was like a few boxes ago, collector box. I think it was the first collector box where we got tons of like borderless cards in that second rare spot. Marble Gargoyle, Undead Augur. Bone Shards, followed by Chainer, Nightmare Adept, Foil Etch, which we pretty much get every box. And then a, uh, hey Ethan, you want to take a shot at saying that word, that card again? I'm not even going to give it a try. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're just going to stick with Asthma Car then. Just because, you know, y'all have heard me try, try to say it a couple times. Phyrexian Germ Food. Token. Asthma car. The dude on the, what's it, the Commanders? Uh, yeah, Jimmy Wong. Yeah, that dude says it like, it just rolls off his tongue like it's a normal word. Ridiculous. There's a man ran the car. That's how you say it right there. Road to Ruin. Seal of Removal in a foil edge swamp followed by Resurgent Belief Borderless. We got a ravenous squirrel. That's the best one. I could do. That's an arm sticking out of there. I didn't even realize that. 
There's an arm sticking out of there, a pumpkin, a wing. It looks like an apple, and now he's bringing a snake up there. What? What a verdant command. Got the stuff coming out the back of the squirrel's head. It's kind of odd. Abundant Harvest, Glimmer Bairn, Brainstone, and then an Enchantress's Presence Foil Etched. There we go. Gaia Drone Dahada, Mythic Rare Planeswalker Foil Sketch Art. It just looks so cool. I just love how they were just like, let's just send it looking unfinished. It's kind of cool. And just call it a sketch. I think that's magnificent. Ooh, um, I think I'd go with Thibble Thib. Uh, the Asmakar one kind of gives me a headache trying to say, because I got to read it real slow, kind of give myself a few seconds of saying it in my head so that when I do try to say it, I don't sound that stupid, even though it still comes out that stupid. <laughs> what a stack right there, though. That was sweet. Marsh Flats, Solitude, and Gaia Drone, all in... Arts other than regular art. So I'd say that was a pretty sick stack. Our second elemental incarnation at that. All right, we got stack five. Matt, I just want to say I appreciate you for uh, chatting in here with me. Usually Saturdays, nobody's in the chat, and I'm just kind of talking to myself. I mean, technically, I am talking to myself because I'm not hearing anything back, but I read y'all's comments. So it's like we're talking. All right. Oh, what's up, man? Yeah, that was a pretty cool little stack right there. I, yeah, I was kind of curious. I was like, I wonder what's been going on with Matt. There is, like, you, uh, Koi... Like, y'all are the people that are usually in it, like, every day, and y'all both haven't been in a couple of them, so I'm like, I wonder if they good, but I'm not nosy, so. Mog Salvage, Blossoming Calm, and a Foil Edge Island, followed by a Soul Talisman. But I'm glad you're back in the breaks, and every, plus, also, I, every once in a while, I see that you like stuff that I post, so I know, I know you were good. Prophetic Titan, and a Magus of the Bridge. And we've got a Kitchen Imp, Glimmer Baron, Marble Gargoyle. Hey, there we go. Retro Foil Edge Garth. That's a solid hit right there. Man, I opened up I opened up Steven, like four of Steven's collector boxes for him. Mm -hmm. And opened up one Garth. And it was like the retro foil. That's it. He was like, I want I want one of each. <laughs> Eve, Progenitor Ooze. You know how Steven is. He's got to make his collections of every print of a card. <laughs> hey, look at that. That's what I'm talking about. We helped Matt finish a, uh, his little collector too, collection, too. Nice. Very nice. He said, I now have a, cop a foil copy of each Garth. That's what, I that's what I'm talking about. All right. Ugh. Still continuing. Just had to grab some more sleeves real quick. Thought I grabbed enough, but apparently not. All right. We've still only gotten two fetches, guys. So let's get it. And there's, we're on the last technically stack and a half. Counterspell, Glorious Enforcer, and a Foil Edge Swamp followed by... A, when you ask, you shall receive, right? Borderless Misty Rainforest. That's our second Misty. That's cool. Abundant Harvest. Into a Sylvan Anthem sketch. Non-foil this time. Faithless Salvaging. Vile and Tumor. Seal of Cleansing. Into a Timeless Dragon retro foil etch. I feel like we get these a lot. Starting to. And in the big boy, big boy spot. Big spoy, really? Told y'all I make up words sometimes. You got Borderless Foil Mythic Rare Grief, our third elemental incarnation of the day. That's sweet there. A Squirrel Bird token. Squirrel Bird. So third stack in a row, getting the incarnation. 
another fetch. A sweet Garth. Cannot forget about that Garth. That's probably the hit right there, the stack anyways. The, bit, the, the main hit, at least. Y'all get what I mean. All right, last stack of the day. Back over to Chris. All right. Yeah, <laughs> that was a pretty sweet last pack. You're celebrating like Italy won the Euro again. <laughs> All right, here we go, Chris. Getting through your first couple commons right here. We've got a Seal of Cleansing, Combined Chrysalis, Foil Edge Planes, and a Void Mirror. Not play free spells. Oh, colored free spells. World weary sketch into a harmonic prodigy. And ever since that one day where we got it in like the third or fourth Modern Horizons break, we've get we've gotten this card like every break. Because remember, I seen the card and I was like, "Yo, we haven't pulled this yet." Ever since then, pulled it every time. Underworld Hermit, Talisman of Curiosity. And a Changeling Outcast. Okay, not the card I thought we were going to... There we go. Goblin Engineer Foil Edge. Retro Frame. And then... A Diamond Lion Borderless Foil. That's a pretty sweet pool. I think Diamond Lion's sick. Da tap it, discard your hand, sacrifice it, and add three mana of any one color. Activate only as an instant. We have pulled Force of Negation, but you weren't in there. <laughs> On Wednesday, I pulled uh, I pulled the second one. Squirrel Thopter. But yeah, I pulled a second one. The dude, I didn't think I was going to either, because I had pulled one, I think, like, middle of last week sometime. It was when I did the draft booster with the collector booster. I pulled the, um, I think it was Retro Foil. And then this past Wednesday, I pulled another one that was retro foil etched. <laughs> oh yeah, we we never pull those things. I get I get where you're going. I get where you're going. Yeah, we never pull force and negations. We'll probably never get them. Query on Ranger, Clattering Augur. This is the last pack of the day. Foil Edge Forest into a borderless chitter spitter. Best card in the game right there. Launching acorns at you all day, homie. Got a Floodhound into a Titania Protector of Argoth. Mythic rare elemental creature. Borderless art. So that's pretty sweet. It's not the incarnation, but still a borderless mythic. Blacksmith skill. Man, that'd be wild, though. But we don't pull those. They're not in this set, right? Gargadon. Nested Shambler, Dothy Voidwalker for the Foil Etch Rare, uh, Eve Progenitor Ooze for our last rare of the day for Modern Horizons 2, Borderless Foil, and our last token for Modern Horizons 2, Crab Squirrel Token. Yeah, sometimes I'm a little slow, Matt, I told you, man, and the office is hot, so I'm kind of... Uh, you know, I'm not going to lie. I'm partially retarded. So, <laughs> you know, I, I just, I've seen that, that meme last night where someone's trying to help someone out and they're like, you know what? I'm not going to lie. I'm just partially retarded. <laughs> but I caught on, Matt. I caught on. <laughs> um, I appreciate you guys for buying in. Thank you guys so much. I hope you guys have a fantastic, amazing Saturday night, uh, Sunday. And then uh, we'll see you back again on Monday. Be kind, be 